now we're going to talk about TSM. Where do they land? Oh, yeah. Whew. Let's hold it. Either. Off the hell. Like, but here's the thing. I know, I, I don't think talent-wise, I don't think talent-wise they would lose qualifier hell. But doesn't it feel like this team and everything behind them, it just feels like this would be the team to lose in qualifier hell? Like, this would be the first Western yes. team. To, like, yes, it, it does. Every, every, everything feels like this would happen. Where I can see Arda being like, guys, time to talk about it. First team ever. The first <laughs> Western team to ever not make it out of qualifiers. TSM, what went wrong? And then, like, <laughs> like, like, I, like, I can see it. It's so there. Like, it's something like it's not shocking if that happens because you can just see the storylines unraveling. But even though I'm sure a lot of chat saying qualifiers, 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 I do think that like they have the right blend of experience and talent. Where I don't think Bjergsen would let them fall qualifiers. I do think Bjergsen would. He would drag this team to top to the group stages if it, if it cost him his last life. Like he would do it. But Spika in qualifier scares me. I know Spika has a lot of potential, but he's had some really bad games this play, and he's looked better as of late. But the Golden Guardian series gives me a lot of wary. Like, sure, ooh, they beat Dignitas. Ooh, they beat the five and thirteen Dignitas. Ooh. Like, I don't think anyone, I think any team they face at Worlds in the qualifiers is going to be better than that Dignitas team. So, they're going to have to be a lot better than Golden Guardians to do anything in the group stages. I, I, my, my trust in this team is, is not really there. And I'm not, I'm going to say group stage plaza, I'm going to say the bomb of group stage plaza. I, I, but I, like, the, oh, just inside of me, like, you can see it. Like, as a North American reporter, as someone who, who, regularly backs and wants to see NA succeed on the global level and national level. I can just I can just see all the tweets at me when TSM loses the qualifiers. It it's I'm already envisioning so, it. But for me but I'm saying Okay, yeah, so I'll where say are we putting it? Maybe yeah. just above SK. Like I do not believe yeah. in this TSM team at all. Maybe it's because again, like I don't think a win over Dignitas is super impressive and their Golden Guardian series was not great. Uh, they they kind of looked progressively worse as that series went on. They didn't seem to have some. They didn't seem to have uh, had some answers for what GGS were throwing at them. Uh, despite the fact that you know GGS weren't weren't picking anything like super extraordinary. Um, yes, I'm talking about the Morgana. Uh, I think, you know, like, uh, it's really hard for me to believe in this TSM team, but again, I mean, if they don't, if they, if they qualify as, as NA3 and they don't make, they don't make groups, that would certainly uh. be a story. Uh, but uh, yeah, let's put them like just above SK. I would put SK above if they had trick, obviously, but since we already know that he won't be going with them to Worlds, that's where I'd put TSM right now. I don't really have a lot of faith in this team. Crazy to it's, it's 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 crazy to think that this is how we're talking about a team that has double lift and Bjergsen on it. I mean, especially they tried to, since they tried the last to run time it they back, spoke, essentially. Yeah, like, and running of, it back and didn't it didn't work, work as well as yeah, yeah, as well as they thought.